is good you is your boy time back here with another video and in this video today guys we're gonna be doing a gameplay featuring the duo of Scotty Barnes and Spicy P Pascal Siakam so we're gonna be talking about them separate and what they do look like with the duo. I will say Scotty Barnes sees a bigger uh, impact with the duo compared to Pascal Siakam. So let's just briefly talk about the cards separate. So Scotty Barnes, 84,000 MT. Pascal Siakam, 183,000 MT. Now, obviously, I locked in for James Harden. So I have them both. And honestly, by themselves, they're pretty good. So Scotty Barnes, let's talk about it. With the duo, obviously, the, sh uh, the close shot goes up to a 91. Its base is an 88. What else increases? Perimeter and ear interior. Those both go up six. Rebounding each goes up two as well. And so that's really what his uh, what his stats look like. By themselves, without the uh, without the duo, really solid. So, I mean, look, if you want to run Scotty Barnes without the duo, again, I think it is really solid in general. Now, it's important to note, in here, what I'm about to show you guys, the badges don't even update. So, I mean, Scotty Barnes, only two Hall of Famers. Now, with the duo, he also gets Hall of Fame catch and shoot, vice grip, and a clamp. So, some really good badges, as well as acrobat, fearless finisher. But these are his base badges, and look at how good they are by themselves. Now, yes, I would give him pick dodge, I'd give him rebound chaser, box out beast. But again, when he gets the duo, the rebound chaser goes to gold anyways, so I'm not really super worried about it. Now, for Spicy P, his upgrades aren't super important or valuable. You know, midi goes up, uh, uh, up six, which does matter. Speed goes up three, which I guess matters quite a bit. Interior up four. So I can't say they don't matter as well as the strength goes up 10, which is huge. The only way I'd run Spicy P, I guess, is with the duo, just because without it, I'd still rather run guys like Chris Bosh. But badge-wise, he is so good. I would say it like this. Pascal Siakam and Scotty Barnes can go out there and compete with anybody at their respective positions. Now, are either of them the best at their positions? I don't think so, but I'm telling you, when you run them together, they're something special. Now, when it comes to what badges to apply, I think it's pretty tough for like Siakam badges to apply after that, after obviously the Evo, you're looking at guard up and ankle braces are the main two I see. It might be different on next gen, but those are the main two I see. For Scotty Barnes, I mean, pick dodger. That's really the only badge that he does not have um, after after the duo. Now, without the duo, obviously, you got to look at things a little bit differently. With Scotty Barnes' release, I'm going to say it like this. I think it's better than it was last year. His release still, in my opinion, is decently slow and baited. But when it comes down to it, he's going to have Hall of Fame catch and shoot. He should not miss for you guys on the court. Release basically what it was last year. I just think it is slightly better. So that's kind of my opinion on the release of Scotty Barnes. In my opinion, pretty slow, pretty uh, baited. But he still is going to be able to knock down shots for you. And I don't think you're going to have too much trouble with it. He should not miss for you. Now, with Pascal Siakam, similar to Scotty Barnes. Not a great release. Neither of them have a great release. I do think release wise, they're relatively the same as far as which release is better. Pick who you want. I feel like right now I'm greening more with Siakam, but who knows? In game, I might be 50 with Siakam and chick with Scotty Barnes. Either way, I feel like it's going to take you guys a little bit of getting used to their respective releases. For Spicy P, his leaner is really solid. Uh, going right, going left, it is absolutely horrible. So just again, another thing to keep in the back of your minds. When running Pascal Siakam, know his leaner going left is just not going to be able to happen. Now, full court dribble six for Spicy P. Let's check him out, and then we'll go to half court, and then we'll go back to Scotty Barnes, see what he's working with. Behind the back, troll, tween, fine, crossover's fine. As far as his half court dribble six, I mean, they're fine. I feel like he moves decent for what he is, a power forward at 6'8". I like Spicy P. Now, when we go back to Scotty Barnes, he's got the D-book dribble style. Now, what does that mean? Well, it means he's going to be able to burst, which is crazy that Scotty Barnes is going to move like this. But he's got the burst, which is just absolutely insanity. Release, again, it's fine. Scotty Barnes, not going to be your primary boy under there. But I do like the fact that he's got that Devin Booker dribble style. Now I matched up with Jay. Jay is one of the sweatiest guys in the my team community. I don't even know how else to phrase it. He's, a phrase it. He's an absolute sweat. Yo, what? About to say, Paul George hitting that. Gold rebound chaser popping up. That's because of the duo. Telling y'all that right now. Got spicy. My jump. Got him. Come on. Come on, Scotty. Scott missed it. 
It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I'm here. Oh my. Oh my, Scotty Barnes. Perfect. Oh my, Scotty Barnes. Diva and Dribble Star. I see you, Scotty. I see what you're getting into, go. My goodness, you're moving. Scotty Barnes. Good take. Thank you. That's a great call, ref. Let's see what the free throw working with, Scotty. Ew, 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 ew. Okay, I wasn't, I wasn't even ready for that free throw. Okay, that's green. 85%. You made me miss it. 7%. I guess. Like, sometimes you just got to give credit where it's due. I felt like I played good defense and he hit a tough shot. Credit. Chill. Hey, Iso Joe. I missed it. Yes, Yako. Oh, my goodness. Spicy P with a big time board out to Scotty Barnes. The duo is looking tough right now. Look at Spicy. Yup, Scotty. Yup, Scotty. Play D for me. Nothing over here. Uh-uh. Scotty sit, man. It's spicy. Ah, that's good D. He played it. That's good D. I'm there, though. I'm there. Good. Board. That's a good box. Spicy P is so elite. Half rebound chaser, too. I love it. Hey! All the way Get to the... over here! Yeah, sometimes you just gotta give credit where it's due. Spawn step. Yes, Yakum. Yo, he just he just put the move on me. Y'all see the move? Oh yeah. Take him inside. Hey, there's the dunk. Where was that at last time, Spicy P? I don't know. It's a good dunk though. Scotty gonna get me a stop in here. That's D, Scotty. As D Scotty run. I threw that. That's me. Iso Joe. Oh my God. Scotty rise up. Let's go, Scotty B. He hoping for me. We've got the duo back in the game. We also got Mr. James Harden back in the game. And he's fresh. I played my second unit for probably longer than I normally do. But that's okay. Because I wanted them fresh for my fourth quarter, ultimately. My lurk. Oh, my gosh. They didn't let me get it. That's fine. We're moving. Look at Harden. Look at Harden. Look at James. Look at James, that's D. Look at James Harden. I right, run. Oh my, Scotty B. Yo, patience. He trying to switch all these screens. We're not watching it. Scotty Barnes making the play from Big Will Chamberlain. I'm on, get a stop or two, Ty. I'm on it. I'm there, Cookies. Spicy P, hop interceptor. Hop interceptor, yeah, Spicy P. Do something for me. Hop interceptor going crazy. Scotty and Siakam, y'all might not think they've done much, but they're just playing their role. That's a great contest, and guess who? Pascal Siakam. Oh my, Scotty, that's a tough take by Scotty Barnes, man. That's tough. He got a weird catch and everything. Look at the switch ability. Look at the switch ability. Look at the switch ability. I mean, they're everywhere. Throw it to him. James, 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 hey James. GG's to my opponent. Now when you look at this duo, no, they're not gonna score the ball a ton. Scotty can give you that occasional one. 
but they are going to play so much defense. This duo defensively is pure lockdown. And look at their total badges. It's absolutely ridiculous. Now, again, when you do look at their badges, I would encourage you guys to go to 2K Database and look how their badges shape up post-Evo to know what to apply. Like, even for, for Scotty Barnes, for example, he still does not get pick dodger. And so that is the one of the main things that I would focus on on you know giving the card before you know anything else even even like rebound chaser like you could give it to him but he's gonna get that automatically with the duo boost now again both these cards by themselves solid with each other absolutely elite that's gonna wrap it up for our video drop a like on it subscribe if you're doing as always man i love you guys have a blessed day